we're going to take a closer look at hardness. Not all water hardness is the same. We have temporary hardness, like what's found in tap water or uh, this water here. We have permanent hardness, which is the hardness found in all third wave water. So this experiment here, we have 150 milliliters of tap water, uh, and this was cut down to a TDS of about 140, 142. And this is uh, calcium bicarbonate, which is in the tap water here at Third Wave Water. And then we have in this beaker 150 milliliters of Third Wave Water Espresso Profile. And it is about the same TDS. What we're going to do is we're going to boil them both off. And then we're going to discuss the differences. Okay, you can see the water here is finished uh, evaporating out and they've cooled off and as you can see there's kind of a white powder at the bottom of each. What we're going to do now is add 150 milliliters of distilled water into each of them. So we'll do this here. Boop. You guys can't see that. Okay, and we're going to stir it up a bit. And tap water, stir it up a bit. Let's see where we're at. It hasn't take, had much time to dissolve, but we'll see where it's at now. Let's see. It's climbing, it's at one. 14, 110 now, 120, 130, oh, sorry, 131, that's third wave water, it's still climbing, and the tap water is at 37, 37. <clears throat> okay, they've sat here a little bit longer, we're going to check the TDS again, and I have something else to show you, so the third wave is at Let's see, 135, and the tap water is at 44. What I really want you to see is we're going to pour out these. And look at the bottoms. So the top one is third wave water, and then the bottom one, you can kind of see it there. You see all that white film left over? That's the hardness that was left over that is going to scale and that's going to keep happening every cycle of water you go through and that scale will slowly build up and then will ruin your machine in very short time. So that's the difference between temporary and permanent hardness.